folks that you can see here that we have all the ingredients needed to make the oreo ice cream firstly we have two flavors of oreo one is the original which is the vanilla flavor and another one is the chocolate cream which is my favorite and i have chosen dutch lady as the milk because the dutch lady is a good quality milk and i like it lastly we have cloud nine classic party pack this is something that's going to make the ice cream supreme and to be fine in taste. Can't wait to do it. Right, welcome to Rainbow Blanc Kitchen here. This is Temp. This permanent MCD when speaking, as usual. You know me, isn't it? So, I'm going to make an ice cream. This is my recipe. I hope it will be a success because I believe it will. Hope every one of you enjoyed this simple recipe. Because this recipe will make a kick to all the kids in your home until we wreck down the White House. Bye. So, folks, this is the first step. Put all the Oreos only in the blender so you have to blend it. So, guys, let me give you some tips. When you want to blend the Oreo, make sure you don't blend it 100%. Just blend it enough for 70%. Don't make sure it's not too cracky. Because so we can make some chips in that ice cream. So it will be even delicious and crunchy when you eat it. I'll show you the result after I blend it. See ya. Okay guys, you can see that we have put a pepper below these items. So if there's any crumb, biscuit crumbs that will messy up the kitchen, it will be easier to clean because it will be on the pepper. So you have to wrap it and just throw it. Simple as that. So you can see it is simple as ABC. Guys, you can see that we have milk that I showed you earlier and we, this is the blend 75% blend Oreo cookies oh yeah before and these are for the topping I forgot to tell you that I sneakily took off some few around four to five Oreo biscuits and cut any shape you want I cut it triangularly and the cloud nine I have cut it square and these are for toppings don't get confused okay this is what we're going to use to do the ice cream and the milk this is the second step and if you can see we have the toppings right over here smooth and easy right folks if you can see on the left side we have the crunchy oreo that we blend for 70 percent for this mix with the milk evenly i give you a tip guys make sure the mixture is not that liquid it should be a little bubbly like this okay not too liquid not too hot it should be in a medium right mixture okay if you can see the topping is just like that we didn't do anything to it so here's what you're gonna do this mixture is going to go right at the refrigerator and this mixture is going to go along with it right folks after we have Taken this for around 4 to 5 hours from the refrigerator. This mixture will be ready as an ice cream. And I'll serve it to you using these toppings as a deliciousness. Add the delicious to other ice cream and I serve the done ice cream to you. You can see it then. See ya. Alright folks, you can see that we have put the cream that is not been in the refrigerator yet. Inside this beautiful mugs and we have put some in this plate so that we can enjoy it after putting it in the refrigerator we also added some milk you can see the milk is floating near around the the ice cream that we put in the middle we will show it to you after we put it in the refrigerator to cool for four to five hours to see the best of the ice cream that we made can wait guys I know you can wait to see too see after four to five hours it's too long I know that Makkale ninga paakkala Oreo ice cream idu yaar senjana en paina senjaadu avaru pa lockdown irukkadala naanga vandu indha mari activity naanga avangalukku kudukrom so ungalku indha Oreo ice cream pidichina like pannunga share pannunga subscribe pannunga to RVK enga team ku nandri en paina ku nandri kadalukku nandri nandri vaanaka